Hello my hair warriors, I'm Aaron O'Brien and welcome to my channel where I'm gonna take you on many hair journeys. But I've got a little secret, I'm packing a piece and not the piece you're thinking about. A hair piece! Yes, this beauty has been on my head for such a long time and I absolutely love it. I've been going through hair loss for quite a long time. I've done Rogaine, I've had hair transplants and this has saved my life. I've partnered with Lord Hair, they're unbelievable. It makes my life so much easier. But I'm gonna show you everything. I'm bearing all. I'm gonna wash this very filthy thing that's been on my head. And then we're gonna show you how to tape it, shaving heads, and then putting it back on at home. So we're about to start the big clean of this disgusting mess. I use, it's called C22. So it's basically a liquid base that breaks down the glue and makes it easier to remove. So you're just gonna spritz it around and you leave it sit for maybe just a couple of minutes. Work it in there and I can already like kind of feel the glue starting to loosen up. See here, but it's starting to pull away. One piece down, five million to go. This is what I recommend is using a bit of cotton wool here. When you run it along, it starts to break down. So you can just like roll little cotton balls with glue on them. And you're gonna work that the whole way through. You can see it's just all coming out there. You're gonna watch me embarrass myself, not wet myself, like not wet myself, but like wet my hair. Okay, here we go. Give yourself the most beautiful head massage you've ever had. That felt so freeing and beautiful. So now that my head is squeaky clean and everything has pretty much been removed, now what you need is obviously a towel to dry your hair. This is a detoxifying shampoo from Blonde Me. Um, it's great. Any cleansing shampoo is really gonna work, even dish soap. So my head's dry. We're gonna take a little bit of alcohol on a cotton bud and then just bring that around the scalp and that will remove literally everything, even your scalp. We are going to measure and then we are going to shave um, the rest of my beautiful head so it can adhere to the scalp super easy. My base is six inches in width and then it gets a little bit narrower to about five and a half to five inches at the back. So measure your six inches from here to here at the front. So you're going to do that the whole way down your head. <sighs> We're gonna use this. Now you'll see how close and the difference when you use this. So you can see my little bit of stubble up here. And then you'll really see how close that gets to the scalp. I'm like an egg. So Lord Hair, thank you. You send these little domes and they come in extremely handy. You wanna just place her over the pizza like this. This makes it very easy to clean and very easy to tape. You get your alcohol. This is just gonna clean any excess residue. Now the taping process begins. I have my Victoria on her dome. We have some hyperhole tape. I really like this one. I also love Lord Hair's and um, their own tape that they have on their website. I mix tapes because who doesn't like to mix tapes? So you're gonna peel back your tape just like this and then you're gonna place it onto your dome making sure that you're placing this as centered as possible now try leave these um, pieces on before you apply it onto your head. So keep those pieces on. Now we have all our taping done. You can see here that I put it fully around the perimeter. Look how tidy that is. Make sure you try to stay as neat as possible and don't go too far off the edges. Again, because you don't want glue melting into your beautiful hair that's actually left on your head. And we have um, these here in the middle as well. Now I do leave gaps here because I just like it to aerate a little bit or as much as possible and it's easier for removal as well but you don't want anyone just pulling your top off so now we're going to put it on my head and I'm going to ask the lovely James to help me. You going to help me James? Oh, yeah. yeah. All right. Now you can apply this directly at the front if you want. All right, here we go. James. Make sure I'm centered here. Oh, do you know what's super helpful actually? If you hold a mirror below you, I put a mirror down like this and you can see the edge. Is that centered, James? Does that look centered to you? So then you're gonna place it on the front, adding lots of tension, sticking that bad boy onto your head so you look so beautiful. Then you're gonna roll back and press as you go. Oh my God, look how pretty I am already. Here we go, pushing it, pushing it, and then, you're pretty again. <laughs> so once you have this on, you're gonna take a towel. Now the way tape works is with pressure. So you're gonna push down so it can adhere to your head. And the great thing about tape is you're not worried about glue getting into your hairline. It makes it super clean, super easy to work with. Look how good that looks. 
I can feel a little wrinkle. If you feel a little wrinkle, you can work it out by just pressing it down, just making sure that you're pulling it so it sits really nicely onto the scalp. This is a godsend. This is great. This is AOB Miracle Spray Detangler. It's great for systems. It'll help detangle it and keep it nice and moisturized. So you're gonna spritz it around and use a wide two comb, even wider than this if you can. Never pull really hard. Always go so gentle when it comes to these things. You'll have a ratchet system afterwards if you don't take good care of it. All right, here we go. So you can see it's starting to take shape. Thank you for watching my videos. Don't forget to click the link, subscribe below, like my videos, and turn on those notifications to see when I put up some new content.